Welcome, welcome back to the channel if you've been here before. Finally have the FJR out. It's been a while. My pops on the red FJR behind me. We are at the entrance gate to Mount Evans. This is the highest paved road in the US. We're gonna reach 14,125 feet, I believe. I'm gonna throw the camera on the helmet. Let's get rolling. As of today, July 13th, 2022, this year, you do have to have a permit to get in here. So just a heads up, make sure you go online, get that permit so you don't get up here and have to turn around. So they require fees between 8 a.m. and 6.30 p.m. All right, passenger vehicle, three day pass, 15 bucks. 12 occupants or more or 30 bucks motorcycles three bucks you know at least we get that reservation crap online and i'll show you how that looks like it's pretty much this you can either print it out or you're gonna have a qr code on your phone that wasn't terrible about 10 minutes th how you doing Summit Lake, nine miles, Mount Evans, 14 miles. No guardrail, nothing. I check out those views. highest paved road in the US but it's definitely not the best maintained road here in the US it's got to take it easy and we have some traffic up ahead I really can't blame some of these tourists coming up here if this is their first time ever driving something like this it could be quite terrifying I mean check out this drop to the left whoa look at this road get some air over here Woo! yeah if you're on a on a motorcycle even a car definitely definitely be cautious on the way up here oh shit this road is getting rough Here come the switchbacks. the hell out of me f-16s right above us oh we have mountain goats might be there on the way back I'll get a better shot of them coming back down we want to make it up here before noon that's when the next wave of cars comes in here and we're on top let me 
who's parking over there. So, summit of Mount Evans, elevation 14,130 feet. Let's go park the bike. When lightning strikes, I wouldn't want to be up here in a lightning storm. You've done it. You have reached the summit of North America's highest paved road, the Mount Evans Byway. Here the splendors of the land and the drama of history lay before you. Check out that photo. Castle in the sky, once the highest structure in the world, this former restaurant was destroyed by fire in 1979. Oh wow. So that was a restaurant back in the day. Beast amid the clouds. Mount Evans is one of the best places in Colorado to see mountain goats. For their safety, observe them for a distance. Yeah, those people are kind of close to them. I don't know if I'll get that close to them, especially with the little ones. Presented by the members of Rotary Clubs in the 113th District, Rotary International, June 1941. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it shows you what mountain you're looking at as you twist this. So we have number one, Mount Eva. Somewhere over there. Perry, James, St. Mary's, Arapaho, Longs. Longs Peak, you can see Longs Peak from here? What is that, five? Five. That away. Okay, so Longs Peak, that's not too far from where I live at. Let's go hop in the castle in the sky. So this was a restaurant before it burned down in 1979. <laughs> Arby's. Should I touch them? Yeah, Arby's. Constructed between 1939 and 1941. 14,260 feet above sea level. Doomsday, September 1st, 1979. A propane explosion destroyed the Crest House. Here's a photo of it. You can barely make out the road down below that we came up. There is an observatory around the corner. I'm not sure if it's open to the public. We cannot get to the observatory that's close to the public. It's behind the castle in the sky there. We pulled the bikes up for a sec to get some nice photos. There are some storm clouds up above, so we should probably get rolling out of here. our way down because looks like there's a rainstorm coming in enjoyed the ride along to the top of Mount Evans, the highest paved road in the United States of America.